I'm coming here from two perspectives. Actually, what was not mentioned is that I spent my last 14 years in the semiconductor industry. So, what I'm going to talk about is the semiconductor industry. And of course, uh, I would like to make a safe harbor statement. All the statements that I'll be making is only solely mine. It does not reflect the views and opinions of the University of the Philippines. Institute for Small Scale Businesses, anything that you use will be my own, my own for funding or something that will always be mine. That is one of the most important messages that I would like to share with you. We have to be consequential. Anything that we do, all of you here are managers. The most important expectation from managers is a three little word, sir. We are all managers, right? So remember always the word, sir. What does it represent? Our results. We are managers, we call respected to provide results. And results are not enough. We have to have the letter I. And we have to talk about improvement. We have been talking about Lin Six Sigma for the last how many hours? For the last 12 hours or so. And the most important is not all changes will result in improvement. We are talking about here of changes that will result in significant improvement. We're just talking about 1%, 2%, 3%. We're talking about order of magnitude improvement. If you're trying to reduce cycle time, a 1% improvement is not a good improvement. We are talking about doubling the improvement. Do it in half the time. That is the main expectation of Lean Six Sigma. The third one is basically we're talking about sustainability. And I salute Ben. Ben, thank you for such an inspiring message to reify government. I think one of the things that I would like to do, since I also represent the government here, is to really respond to some of the issues that were put forward by Ben. We are going to reify government. But the biggest challenge that I think Ben did not elaborate on this that one of the biggest impediments is population. The Philippines is a big organization, it's a big enterprise of about 92 million people. Your customers are 92 million people. Your budget is equivalent to the revenue of Intel in 2010. Just consider that. And what is our per capita income today? You know what the per capita income is today? Which is actually the measure of your productivity. What's the per capita income of the Philippines? About 6,400 per month in pesos.